So my name is Luisa. Uh, I'm a project manager in Latin startups. I'm from Brazil. And my name is Nancy Rivas. I am originally from Mexico. Uh, my name is Jordana. I'm from Brazil also. My name is Alberto Martinez. I'm from Mexico City. And my name is Gabriela Latif and I'm the marketing and events coordinator here at Latam Startups. I am from Indonesia. I am not a Latin American at all. <laughs> <laughs> I do get a lot of questions on why my name is Gabriela. Uh, my name is Miriam Lazarte. I'm the CEO of Latam Startups. And uh, Latam Startups started in 2016 as a nonprofit organization. And at that time, really, uh, we didn't have like a big group and a, a big team. Uh, we started with the minimum uh, number of people around and lots of volunteers. And today, we're very proud to have uh, you know 16 people working directly with us. With five uh, members a score of the organization. I love the experience because we have uh, the opportunity to be uh, in charge and to understand better how the, the business works, the entire world. Um, having the opportunity to actually, for the first time in, in my professional career, organize and manage and putting together a focus group, I think it's been quite an experience. <laughs> their perspectives from the different cultures, their business ideas and tapping into their minds are just amazing. They have this amazing, amazing ideas. And I get to pick up a few languages along the way. So <laughs> I started to um, learn Portuguese from yeah. them as well <laughs> because I hear it every day at the office, also Spanish. We have become like a really strong team. I think like let's uh, give a lot of opportunity to people because we have a lot of volunteers yeah. so they can like uh, starting to work in the business uh, as a first experience, I think it's it's wonderful. And I'm very proud of this group. I'm very proud of my people. Uh, they are all newcomers. They are all representative of um, uh, you know minorities uh, in our community. And we are working for international tech companies uh, to help them to enter to Canada. Working with LATAM, uh, it's been an amazing experience. I feel very lucky to have this opportunity. I think we would definitely recommend uh, um, anyone to work with Latin startups to gain again like experience in working in Canada, this culture intelligence because you'll be working with people from all over the world, <laughs> which yeah. is amazing. So today, uh, you know, under COVID-19, we changed the perspective of Latin startups and we started to uh, instead of have just volunteers hire them as part of our team and we hope to continue with that in the next three years and we hope to continue bringing more companies not just from latin america but also from emerging countries uh, in other parts of the world to get to know a lot of companies from all over the world with different products and most of them with the incredible capabilities to actually grow in the Toronto ecosystem. Um, so I'm very proud that uh, you know at this point we have a very uh, unique team that with all the diversity and all the experience that they are bringing to the community, we really, really are making a difference in the ecosystem. Nice. Ooh, okay. Nice. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah.